When Moses encountered Jesus under the appearance of a burning bush, he asked God his name. God said, I am who am. And ever since, this name, translated into English as I am, has been used to refer to God. Hello, I'm Father James Kubicki, and one of the reasons that Jesus was persecuted and ultimately killed was because he used this name to refer to himself, thus declaring that he was God. We find instances of this throughout the Gospel of John, and in chapter 8, verse 28, we hear Jesus saying, When you lift up the Son of Man, then you will realize that I am, and that I do nothing on my own but say only what the Father taught me. The lifting up here, of course, refers to the crucifixion of Jesus when he was lifted up on a cross. But how could that help people realize that Jesus is I am, that he is God? In his first New Testament letter, John famously wrote, God is love. And what is the greatest expression of love? To lay down one's life, to die for another person. That's what Jesus did when he was lifted up on the cross. He showed us the greatest love the world has ever known. So, when Jesus was lifted up on the cross, he revealed to the world that God is love. He showed the world that he was, I am, God himself. What does this God who is willing to die for his human creatures want? Pope Benedict once put it this way, on the cross, it is God himself who begs the love of his creature. He is thirsty for the love of every one of us.